Hey gamers, Mammal Gamers here and welcome back to another video. Today's setting is a bit different. This is the legendary balcony door that always ruins the lighting when we sit over there in the corner where we normally film. There is science and scientific proof. So, you've read the title and I did not kid you. Today we are trying out a serum for over two hundred US dollars. I'm gonna go into detail for the pricing because in euros it's a bit cheaper for over a week. Glamorous, if that sounds interesting to you, then keep on watching. The 24th of November, I'm gonna do this experiment and I really want to record it even if it might not be good and I, if I won't post it. But if you see it, I have posted it and I deemed it good, so you know what. But we are trying out the Abbe Royale Double R Renew and Repair Serum. I have this here. This is a maxi size tester. In here are, and I'm showing you, eight. We have eight. Things. What is that? And I'm gonna test them for a week. Period. It states it's a sample size created to show results within seven days. You see it here? You see it? See it? Do you, do you see? Yeah, here, here, here. This product retails on Sephora for $215. Dollars in Austria, you could get it for only 168 euros at Douglas, which is a lot cheaper actually than 215 dollars. But uh, nevertheless, Gerle, you know, is expensive, it's luxurious, it's fine. However, the ingredients are not fine, and I'm gonna say this here out loud denatured alcohol basically ages you over time, which is just a choke that this is included in an anti-aging product that is way over two hundred dollars. I hate it. That's how she looks. It's like just a white kind of lotion. Oh my god, that literally smells heavy. I can't really show you the oil, but it's just a very, very boring translucent oil. So I'm gonna firstly grab her the lotion that smells like straight up fragrance. I'm gonna break out so badly, I already see that. We're just gonna massage it in, I would say. First impressions, I like it. I like the experience, I'm not gonna lie, I like the experience. I mean, I don't like the ingredients, I really don't. So, we're gonna see over the week how my skin changes, if she gets better, if she gets worse, if she gets more wrinkles because of the natural alcohol. Hello you guys, I'm so sorry for the low quality, I'm filming this with my uh, phone. We are on... Uh, day five actually, so we have four, okay, one, two, three, four. I just literally didn't do anything and I don't get it why. I'm gonna give you a, a very, very close up. So, you see nothing really has changed. There are no special wrinkles. There are, you know, no wrinkles cured. But yeah, this is check-in on day five and I literally don't see any difference. So, hey you guys, we are at the end of this video. Officially, this box here, uh, this eight day tester is empty. We've tested it for eight days straight. Basically, I think the final thoughts are not that surprising. Uh, if you if you listened closely throughout the video. Uh, this whole video basically just was uh, to show you that uh, price does not equal quality price does not equal good ingredients. I do not see any difference in my skin. I don't feel younger. I uh, don't feel rejuvenated. Uh, I, I do want to be honest. I do know that this gonna uh, age me over time just because this literally has such a high amount of denatured alcohol in it that it's disgusting that this is sold for over $200. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. This video doesn't really have a deeper sense because I did not go into this review thinking that it would really work out. Uh, I read the ingredients and know that it didn't, so we're just gonna put it away. Uh, yeah, you guys, I don't know, it's just let me in the comments down below what you think about this video, what you think about those tester videos. I do have some more plus size testers from brands that are uh, less problematic, I'm just gonna call it that way, because from now on, I think Gerlo is a brand that is officially problematic for me personally. What do you think? Do you think that 
buying expensive means buying quality is coming from me is, is very surprising I feel for a lot of you guys because I am someone who always tells you to buy in a higher price category just to get better quality but at the same time I don't think that this is necessarily the truth which is the reason why I wanted to do this video I'm so sorry that I look literally disgusting throughout this whole video don't worry in in the next videos and also in earlier videos you're gonna see me with a full face of makeup on because that is not camera friendly I'm aware of that but you guys if you enjoyed this video please 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 give a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and ring the notification bell to get notified when I post new videos normally every Monday to Saturday at 12 p.m. Central European time cameras I love you so much and we're gonna see us tomorrow. Mwah. Bye!